Mark here from Mark's Reviews and Tutorials. I'm going to give you a quick uh, little tutorial on how to set the um, brake warning uh, lights on your BMW. This is a 5 Series 2007. This is actually an E61. E60 is exactly the same. The one is just meaning that it's a uh, station wagon or an estate. So what we do with your foot not on the brake and the key in the ignition, press the start stop button once, that'll take us to accessories or position one, press it again, that'll take us to position two. So we're now on and everything's coming up and starting. What we're gonna use is the little um, odometer reset button down here, that guy there. So we're gonna press and hold that and keep it in until we go, we'll go past the triangle there, here we go to that setting there. Now by toggling through, as we press it, it'll go to the different settings. That's your um, brake fluid. And that one there is your oil, that's been reset. And there is your rear brakes, that's on 47,000. If I press and hold that, it'll come up. No, it didn't come up. Let's try that again. Press and hold to get it to go, it must have been a little bit slow. Through the triangle, through to the brake reset, toggling through to the rear brakes. There it is, press and hold, it's on 47,000 at the moment. Reset, do I want to reset? Lift up, press again, and it goes to the blank. Now let it go, and then it goes to 50,000. So it is now reset um, and won't go off for another 50,000 kilometers. So there you go, there's your reset function. Front brakes, rear brakes. Now my front brakes need a new sensor, so let me show you that one, because that's interesting, um, because it will not reset and that means it needs a, a new sensor. There's the front brakes, I'll press and hold. It's saying minus 15,000 reset, yes please, I want to reset, um, but when I hold it down and let it go, it won't actually reset because that brake, front brake sensor is um, not letting it. So I need to replace that front brake sensor and then it will reset. But if you're getting that situation where it's just staying with the dotted lines or staying with a minus 15,000, which is the maximum, it was actually on minus 2,900 when I tried to reset it and it's gone to minus 15,000. That's showing that I need to replace the brake sensor. The brake sensor is not an expensive part. Uh, you just got to take the wheel off and there's only one for the front, one for the back. Um, and you just replace that sensor uh, and then you'll be able to reset that light at that point.